Alright, I was asked by another YouTuber that watched my um, review of the Sawyer water filter with the lab results. He asked me if I would do the Chinese knockoff version and sent me a link on Amazon. So, this is the easiest suck water filter short paragraph portable personal emergency water filtration purifier for travel, camping, survival, hiking, and backpacking. And it was a whopping $9.99. So, this is what I ended up getting. Um, obviously, it is um, got a label here, made in China. Let's see what we have. Oh. And there you go. Comes with a straw. You got your filter here, and you have some instructions. So it looks like you can connect it to bottles, bags, and all that stuff. Oops. Oh yeah, it's threaded there for bottles to go on, and this is where you would, I guess, hook this straw to, to or I guess you would just suck right there, and this would go on there. Yep, that's how I guess it works. Yeah, that's how they show it. All right, well, next thing to do is head off to the lab and let them test it out for me. Uh, no idea what's going to happen here. We'll see. All right, I finally got a chance to uh, take a couple samples to the lab to have them tested. A raw water sample and a sample treated by my uh, Sawyer Mini Chinese knockoff filter and this is the same filter I just previously showed I just peeled the um, camouflage off just to see what it looked like underneath and it just looks like a gray plastic pipe so anyway it's the same one um, for share the results will say this I took the water sample um, I'm sorry I took the water to be filtered from the same place that I got the Sawyer water from but weather conditions here are totally different than it was when I took the one for the Sawyer. Um, it was warmer, it was, the weather was really dry, and lately we've just had tons and tons of rain and no sun. So, with that being said, numbers aren't going to be exactly like the Sawyer filter. So, got analyzed by the uh, City of Newport News Water Department, and uh, here we go. So, the raw water sample go down here to the coliform which is basically just an indicator of harmful bacteria and it covers a wide range of bacteria so from what I understand I'm, I'm no chemist or anything like that uh, no lab person so I'm just going about what I'm told so the raw water had 52 colonies in it and lo and behold the filtered one had less than one which is actually zero but they don't write zero they use less than one for whatever reason and a disappointing uh, with a, the level of colonies in the one that I tested with the Sawyer um, was I think over a thousand thirteen hundred colonies so I'm a little disappointed in these numbers I don't know why it was so clean um, and it also detected a few colonies of E. coli on the Sawyer test but it didn't have any in the raw water of this test so obviously that came back as a less than one so a little disappointed in it, uh, you know, the number of colonies, but nevertheless, I mean, it worked. So, does it work? Yeah, it actually does work. How long will it work? Got no idea. So, I'm kind of thinking this: if somebody wants to uh, send me a comment or uh, send me a message, I will be more than happy. Sorry, be more than happy to send this thing out to you, let you use it. For however long you want to use it and then send it back and I'll test it again as uh, I'd like to see how long it lasts um, because I just don't have time to go use this thing but anyway for now the $7 Amazon Chinese Sawyer mini knockoff filter it actually does work it does more than just make the water clear it actually does uh, clean bacteria out of it so there you go